more food. Can you believe it? More. Oh, my gosh. Hey, uh, the Morning Brew continues. Hello, I'm Larry Ahrens. Our co-host today is Howie Keibel, Community Manager for Yelp. Aaron is out today. But happy Valentine's Day to everyone. Happy Valentine's Day to my wife. Happy Valentine's Day to my wife, Laura. Thank you. Hey, if you have a TV show, you got to take advantage of it, right? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> this has been so fun, Larry. Uh, well, a lot of fun. And uh, now, <laughs> now you're going to be the Yelp guy. I am. Hey, I always gonna... assume, and I, I, I'm sure you do this as well, not everybody's heard of Yelp. No. So you got to educate people. Yelp.com mm -hmm. is a website that does what? Connects people to great local businesses is probably the simplest explanation. Uh, but there are so many things that you can do. You can, it's like having, uh, you know, uh, millions of locals in your back pocket because you can go anywhere in the world and, and, and if you know nothing about the place, you can uh, search your, your phone app and, f and discover great food, doctors, you know, schools, right. plumbers, you know, auto mechanics, you name it, it's going to be on Yelp. And it's going to be locals telling you about what is so great about those businesses. So we, we had B2B Bistronomy on earlier. Right. Um, that business is really highly ranked on, on Yelp for good reason. And if you go on, you can read the reviews of why that's yeah. the case. Yeah. So, uh, and today is a good example. Uh, what, I'm, what I'm talking about are new businesses in Albuquerque. Great. That are already being yelped. People are already saying, These are, this is awesome. Go check it out. Incredible. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, let's start, obviously. Uh, yeah. We've got some pictures to go along with this as well. Okay. Um, so maybe we can. I think the first one is the brew. The brew. Not related that to would the be morning brew. Not but related, but, but a great place to grab a cup of coffee. So this is a downtown cafe that just opened up off on Gold Street. I want to say between 3rd and 4th. Uh, the, here are a couple of the products that they that they carry. They have Via Maria or Miriam, Via Miriam coffee beans. Um, really considered one of the very best in the state. Um, I would definitely put them up there with Michael Thomas is probably the best uh, coffee that you can get nice. in, in town. It's really mellow, but it's got a kick. It will wake you up quickly. <laughs> uh, they also have some nice teas, um, and. Uh, um, and and really, it's it, what a great uh, atmosphere, what a great lo uh, locale to go, just sort of relax Good in the morning. Place to hang out. Uh huh. Do some work. Yeah, they really have they, conversations. Uh huh. They're not going to pressure you to to get another cup of coffee. They let you kind of sit back and enjoy the place. Beautiful. So it's really nice. Okay. Uh, next place would be probably the Stumbling Steer. Okay, so this uh, place. I've heard a lot about this place. Good. What have you heard? I've heard that these guys that r run it. Uh, Great background, and yeah. they uh, they bring a lot to this, and they've been working on this for a long time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's been so a lot of anticipation open. for this thing. It yeah. actually opened up; it had its grand opening on Wednesday night. So we're just it just opened, but it's already getting great Yelp reviews. It ha it is a brewer and a gas gastro pub on Ellison near Co Cottonwood Mall. Yeah, uh, Kirk Roberts is the head brewmaster. Among other things, he won the 2012 gold medal for the American Scotch Ale at the Great American Beer Festival. So the guy knows what he's doing. He's got a pedigree there. Uh-huh. Thanawat Bates, is the, or Chef T, is the uh, head chef. He has previous experience in Los Angeles, Vail, Colorado, Washington, D.C., and Denver. Um, and then menu highlights. Really interesting stuff on this menu. Um, Southwestern poutine. Uh, ginger beer braised pork belly, Korean style baby back ribs. There's a lot of stuff to go after here. All right. And seven house brews. So I'll just give you uh, this is a t shirt from the Stumbling Steer. That's the logo. There you go. There's That's a good logo. Glass. Okay. All right. Let's go to this pizza that's sitting here tempting the crew. Wise Pies. Okay. Yes. Uh, another really highly reviewed. Uh, new business. I think they've only been open a couple of weeks. Um, they're a new venture from Vernon's Steakhouse. Ah. So you know that they do it right at the steakhouse. They're going to do it right with pizzas. Uh, they always, one of the things I love about this place, I've been in twice, but as soon as I open the door, they say, welcome to Wise Pies. Someone is there greeting you. Good. Um, and the pizzas, all the pizzas are six ninety five. dollars Really? Uh, all of them. As many ingredients as you want. Um, you can choose from like sort of their... Uh, fr from their own menu, or you can build your own, and literally any as many ingredients as you want. So this guy right here is the Sicilian, uh -huh. and then we have the f the, the Fredo, um, and this 
This one is with has a gluten free crust. Um, you can tell that these things are uh, quickly you know, fired up, fire baked. They uh, look uh, awesome. And it's really you can get these pies in about five minutes, even when the line is packed. They just send you right through. They've got high quality ingredients. It's a great place. Cool. And there's more. Listen, go to Yelp.com. Howie will uh, supervise the, uh, <laughs> the the whole Albuquerque community. Get and a free he, account. He knows. It's easy. All right. We're going to be back. Uh, Howie's staying with us. He's our co-host today as well. All right. We have uh, Boris McCutcheon and Alex McMahon here playing uh, live in the studio. They're going to be next for a performance when we continue on The Morning Brew. Fantastic.